Okay, and then I have like this huge bag full of other things that I got. <laughs> it is so funny. It's a boutique. <laughs> Going from the top, I mean the bottom, and then curling it like this. Okay, I have to show you this laundry bag that I got from Taiwan because it's so funny. <laughs> so this is um, a character. It's called La Bi Xiao Xing in Chinese. I don't really know how to pronounce Xin Chan. I've never said it in English before. Um, but I'll open it up and show you. So basically there's two pieces and one of them is like his underwear and it's so funny. Look at it. You can put your intimates in here in your underwear bag. And then the other one is just really cute, but it's a, it's a normal bag. It's lime green and then it zips open like any other. So I'm gonna throw these in the wash with my clothes. And then yeah, well, I, the only reason I bought it is because of it's so funny. <laughs> How do I have this many dishes for one person? Literally, I just cleared it yesterday morning. I don't know how I go through all of this. But anyways, let's clear it up. So I've been obsessed with the Trader Joe's hot and sweet jalapenos. Um, I can't get them though because there's nowhere near Canada. The, I think the nearest store is like a two and a half hour drive. So I like adding these on my avocado toast when I want like that extra flavor. I think these taste really good. And breakfast is served. Also, do you like my lounge shirt? Isn't it so cute, but scary at the same time? Okay, so I'm basically ready um, since I got up so early this morning, but there's still like 30 minutes before my parents come. I just want to show you the bag that I got. So this is basically Tainan, which is the a city in Taiwan. It's the city where I was born, and there's just like a bunch of food around it. And then my parents got me this. This is my name in Chinese. And then I bought this hair clip when I went back. I thought it was really pretty. And it's really big as well, which I need for my lock of hair. And then I want to show you this. Okay, it's an elephant, but listen, it unzips into a freaking bubble tea holder. Okay, like how cute is that? And there's elephants on here too. And this is a keychain, so I'm gonna put it on my bag. Okay, let's put the thing back. So I think I basically just like roll it up. Look, I have the cutest bag in the world. I probably won't get a drink today. No, I will get a drink because the place that I'm going to, the hot pot place I'm going to, I think for lunch, there's a combo where you can get a drink. So I'm gonna use this. I don't finish it and then tomorrow when I go out with my friends I also bought a bubble tea cup I'll show you tomorrow but I'm gonna bring that so that we can get bubble tea together with my friends okay I'm back because I have so many things to show you okay so this is a little phone pouch this is what my aunt got me and it's so cute okay let me show you so basically you just have to put her in sorry I'm too excited okay and then this is what it looks like isn't it so cute but so she gave me this after right after i bought this so you won't believe how much this is trending in taiwan right now i don't know if it's like asia in general but basically i got a phone case 
that has these little screws at the bottom and then you can hook it on like so like this and then you can also layer it but the only thing is that you can adjust the length of it which i really like and then it just kind of hangs out like that and it's just easier to use compared to this bag, I guess. But this bag is just so much freaking cuter. You just like lift it up and then you can use your phone. So I like bringing this out because uh, whenever I put my phone in my tote bag, I always lose it. Like I don't lose it, but it's like lost in this bag somehow. Do I want accessibility or do I want cuteness? Okay, I am leaving now. Well, my parents will be here like 10 minutes. So I'm just gonna wait downstairs in case they come early. But I do wanna show you my new shoes. I bought it because I saw it on Xiaohongshu, which I was totally influenced. It's like the Chinese version of Instagram. So these are the shoes that I got. <laughs> They're like pretty chunky actually, but it honestly feels really soft on the inside. It's cushioned and I really like the roundness of it. I don't know why. I'm just obsessed with them. But I wear them with socks because it's easier for me to walk in. Okay, so I wanted to do a mini beauty haul of things that I got from Taiwan. It's from this shop called um, Poya or Bo Baoya in uh, Mandarin because I was sorting through everything anyways. But I bought, got a bunch of face masks. So I got three of this kind because I think it was like I too get one free or something. So I just bought the entire line. So one's brightening, one's for oil control, and one's for moisturizing. So we're gonna try that and I'm just organizing it so that my sister and I could try all of these and I got foot and hand moisturizer as well or masks I've never tried these before so I'm kind of excited and then I got my favorite brand ever if you watch my face mask review video this is this is my all-time love and then this one won like a bunch of awards it keeps winning but I just don't like it as much as the gold one. Anyways, I got that. And I also got the red one for brightening. Which I have somewhere here. And then I got um, this sunscreen. It's like the one that I currently use. And I just really like it. It was buy one, one free. So I got four. Two for my sister and two for myself. And then I also got this mask. Which I've never seen before. But I don't know. The packaging just intrigued me. It just says like 2% and 10%. I think it's because it contains something in it, like 2% of something and then 10% of something. This one's brightening and then this one's moisturizing. I'll let you know how I like it. Okay, and then I have like this huge bag full of other things that I got. So let's see. So I got my favorite face wash. This one, it's like a Japanese brand. Um, I got... So this one is 142 milliliters. The one I have is less, but it costs the same. It's like a promotion they're doing. So I got a lot of these since they're the same price, but you get more for your buck. Um, I think I got four. So I got four of them. Yeah, it's my lifetime supply here. And then I also got the OPI Strength. It's just because I saw it. It's not because it's cheaper in Asia, but... Um, yeah, I just got that since I saw it on the way and then more like foot and hand masks I also got like um, what is this like a blender like a foundation Compact thing And then this was free so I'm excited to try all their different products and see which ones I like I got this nail um, gem thing. I keep saying the word thing. Okay, I got this gem collection set. 
and essentially it's just like different types of jewels and it looks like it's silver and blue themed so i'm excited to use that with my new gel nails and then i have um eyeliner this one's my favorite eyeliner but the one i got in canada really disappointed me so i don't know if i should get it in taiwan but the ink doesn't run as well and it's like very light on me and then i got this because this brand has been trending on xiaohongsu which is a chinese version of instagram so then i got that too for mascara and then lastly i just have like the two masks my favorite two favorite masks ever um that i just showed earlier this one again is for moisturizing i believe and then this one is for brightening it's the best brightening mask i've ever used okay so i'm just reorganizing Okay, I also wanted to share these because my aunt made these. Um, these are soap bars and look how pretty they are. Look at that. Look at the design. And this one, the colors are so pretty. I think she might be selling these now because I see that she has a label on the back with like the ingredients. It even shows like the date it was made. How thoughtful. And I want to show you the gifts that I bought for my friends. Um, I've already packaged them, but I'll just open it up to show you. Um, it's like tote bags. So this group of friends, like we always exchange gifts when we go out. So I did buy something like a little more special rather than just giving um, snacks to them. I bought this tote bag. It's so freaking cute. Okay, so it says like um, eats in Taiwan or like it translates it in English, Taiwanese cuisine. And then it has like most of the famous foods that you would find or that are well known in Taiwan. So it's just this very adorable tote bag and it's actually really thick and good quality. The only complaint that I have is that it doesn't have a button or a zipper. And then... There's this bubble tea keychain. I thought it was very fitting. It goes with one of the food items that is shown on here. And then inside, like there's these little pearls. Then they actually move and that is too freaking cute. Okay, so that's basically um, all of them are like that. The only difference is like the inside. So I did gift them all like, a small little hand towel. This one's Totoro. But I bought two Totoro and two Moomins. Um, so I think I'm going to do like a draw. So they'll just pick one of these bags and then get whatever one they um, receive. This one's very cute. So my thought around this is I'm trying to give more sustainable gifts. So this, if they bring it out and they wash their hands, for example, they can use this to dry their hands. Or if they're in a hot country, they can like wipe their sweat with it. Um, so I just wanted something that could help reduce some waste, I guess, when they go out. And then I gave them all each a pineapple cake because they specifically requested it. So yeah, that's the gift. And I'm very excited to give it to them. Although I don't know if they'll like the tote bag because I don't know if it suits all of their styles. But I think all of them will think that it's very cute. So hopefully they use it, but it's okay if they don't. <laughs> Hello, I am ready for bed. It is only 8.30. It's literally so bright outside, like, but I am too tired since I've been up since 4 a.m. So I'm going to sleep now. Good morning, everyone. It's another beautiful sunny morning. It is 7.30 a.m. and my energy is at its peak. I'm always high and energy in the morning and then at around 5 p.m. I slowly start to like shrivel up and need to go back into bed um, but I'm feeling pretty great this morning I have a few plans I am going to brunch and all you can eat brunch with my family my sister is actually treating all of us because she got her first paycheck and then I'm meeting up with some of my friends and bringing their goodie bags to them that I brought from Taiwan so I'm just going to get ready now. Look at the sun pouring in right now. It's so beautiful. 
Okay, so I'm just gonna untie and tie my hair. Whoa, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm gonna untie my hair. This is my favorite part. See the curls set in? And I really like braiding it because I really like this with my bangs. It gives it like that nice um, line and volume. And it always smells really good after I untangle it because I just wash my hair beforehand and then all the smell gets trapped by the braids. And there it is. Now I'm going to get dressed. Hello, I just finished getting ready. Here is the... Here is the outfit. I'm just wearing like this skirt skirt. So it looks like a skirt from the set, but skirt. Okay, anyways, um, I'm gonna have this cardigan in case it gets cold, but it is like a whopping 30 degrees later on today, so I don't think I'll be needing it. And then I really like this top that I got from Uniqlo because it has that like built-in bra. Um, I always like getting the Uniqlo shirts that have that built-in bra so I don't have to worry about it. I could just wear the tank top on its own. So yeah, that's the fit. Anyways, I am going to try this new thing that I bought that I saw. I'm going to try this new thing that I bought from Xiaohongshu. So I got this Face Factory eyelash curler and essentially it heats up and it curls your eyelashes like you would when you curl your hair. I have never used like the curling wand, I don't know what it's called now, the curler because I'm always scared that I'm going to chop off my eyelashes because that's what I heard. So I've never used it before, I've always just been eyelashless. So I really wanted to try this and also my husband's cousin got it after I saw it on social media and she said that it was really easy to use because at first I was a little bit hesitant. So I ended up getting the same brand as her. I'm gonna try it for the first time today. I did watch a few videos, so hopefully I get the hang of it. And I also got this mascara, so I'm gonna try it along with the curler. Ooh, the packaging's really nice. Okay. So the reason why I got this is because the wand is really thin. I feel like the ones in North America are always really thick unless I just haven't really been looking that hard. So I'm going to try this and then this it looks like this. So it kind of looks like um, mascara as well but there's like heat options, one, two, and then it shows the battery on the very last one. You kind of just click it like this. Let's see how it goes. And I actually went to the color analysis thing for my skin type and um, they told me to stay away from warm colors but I already pre-bought this dark brown wand so now I'm regretting it because I should have got black. Dark black and stark white works on me but not like brown. I can breathe throughout that entire thing. It's too focused. Okay, I'm going to do one eye with the... Uh, Heat and see how it goes. So this is what it's like just with mascara. You can't even really tell a difference, like a minor difference. So let's try. Okay, the video I watched, they used the second notch, so I'm gonna try that as well. Okay, I just tried the second notch and I put it on my eyelashes and I could feel the heat. I'm gonna go with one because I got scared. <laughs> so let's try that. Going from the top, I mean the bottom, and then curling it like this. in the mirror but like not vividly unless I really look at it so maybe I'll go in a few more times okay so this is what I ended up with can you tell I think you can kind of tell in the camera okay so this one is the one I did and then this one's just without anything it doesn't have mascara or the curler this one's mascara curler and then I put on mascara again I think I'll get better at it in the future but I can actually see my eyelashes and it's so weird. It's like obstructing my view. Okay, I'm gonna do the other eye and then what time is it? Yeah, it's about time to go soon. 
I'm done. Do you like them? I like them. I think I like did this one this side a lot faster. So I think over time I'll just get more used to kind of like the motion of it. But yeah, you can kind of see that I have eyelashes. They exist. It feels so weird to be able to see them. Like just fuzzy at the corner of my eye. Um, but the only thing is that this now has like mascara on it. So I do have to make sure that I clean this um, after it cools down. It cools and heats pretty quickly. So I really like that. And I just used the first setting because I feel like the second one was really hot. Especially because it's my first time. So I wanted to make sure I don't burn any eyelashes off or even like burn my eyelid. So I just used the first one. But maybe in the future we'll try the second. So I'm going to clean this. Okay, I remember that I was said I was going to show you my bubble tea cup. So I bought this so that I don't have to use one use cups when I get bubble tea, which is pretty often. So the good thing about this is that, okay, look at this first, the lid. It's a bubble tea cup. And you just go like this. And it's a plastic straw, so it's not glass. And you open it up. And inside is like clay um, laminate. So it's all clay based inside, the outside's plastic. So the clay helps it keep things warm and cool. And then the cup, this is why I really like it. So you take this little piece off and it becomes like a larger hole so you can use a bigger straw, which I am gonna change it to because I'm probably getting a fruit drink which will have pulp in it. Okay, so with the larger straw, you just again take that off. And then now you can fit the larger straw. And then this you can keep at home. Or you could take it with you, but I'm pretty sure this is what I'm gonna get. Anyways, going bigger is better. And then it comes with this little holder. So there's like multiple colors. I picked green and pink combo because, I don't know, I didn't want to go with all pink or maroon. So I still need to get like a little lid for my bigger straw. I only have one with a little one because I got a package and it only comes with this one. So I'm now ready to go. I have more things to show. <laughs> okay, so I just wanted, because I was I had this around me anyways. Um. So this charging pack, it's a MagSafe, so is that what it's called? I think so. Um, so basically it like sticks to my phone and then I bought this little sticker which is the magnet thing because this phone case doesn't have it and it just sticks on like that and it charges. And look how convenient it is, I don't even need to ring a cord out. Now I'm ready to go. Okay, so I just got the cakes and now I'm headed to a bubble tea place. We're getting bubble tea together first. Uh, the cakes are so cute. We got a creme brulee one and then she asked if I, she, she wanted, or sorry, she asked us if I wanted brulee for her. I mean, what am I saying? She asked me if I wanted it brulee and I said yes. And then she torched the top. So that was pretty cool. Uh, we got six different flavors. Strawberry, London Fog, Vanilla, Creme Brulee, Hazelnut, Mochi, and then Thai Tea. So I'm really excited to try them. Hello, I am back home now. And I'm just having a little dinner right now because we didn't end up eating. I'm just having leftovers. These are Brussels sprouts and bacon that my mom cooked up and packed for me. And then I have leftover pizza and bean sprouts and chicken. So I'm just going to finish up my dinner and then wash up and get ready for bed. So I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching.